Hey, good morning, guys. Hey, you know, there's a lot of new gun owners out there. They bought a new gun, but you know what? They can't shoot it because they can't find ammo or it's just so expensive they don't want to shoot up what they have. So, you know, if you're going to own a gun and carry it, you really need to become proficient with it. And, of course, you can't do that if you don't shoot it. So, let me give you an alternative to shooting live ammo, and that's actually shooting a BB gun. Now, before you laugh and blow off this video, just I would just want you to know that I used to do a lot of competition shooting back in the 80s and 90s. In fact, all the way up until about 2008. And I actually used to use BB guns to practice with. And here's one of them I actually use. This is actually an Airsoft, but check this out. This one uses uh, AA batteries, but you know, it's plastic, it's light, it feels cheap, but you know what? It's got good sights on it, and it's got a decent trigger, so I can practice my sight alignment and my trigger control. I can also practice my stance, my breathing, and my follow through with something like this. So, what we're going to do is, I'm going to show you three different uh, BB guns. I'll show you what it's going to cost to shoot those. And then my son and I, we're going to set up some targets, do some drills, and we're going to show you guys that you can actually learn how to shoot a real gun by using a BB gun. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, I got three BB guns here. We're going to take a quick look at them. But you know, before we get started, I want you to watch this little video clip I got here. And just be aware that every gun you see in this clip is actually a BB gun. So, if you have a real pistol, there's a good chance that there's a BB gun out there very similar to your real pistol. If not, you can probably find something that's pretty close. But anyways, I got three pistols here. We're going to take a look at this first one. Now this one is just all plastic. This is made by Umarex. It's an XBG. And just a basic simple gun. It's going to cost you about $30. This takes a 19 round magazine. and. Put a CO2 cartridge right there, and she's ready to gun, uh, ready to go. So my three BB guns here only shoot BBs; they do not shoot pellets. So again, about thirty dollars, and bam, you're ready to to do some shooting. All right, my next pistol. Check this out. Now this one will run you between eighty and a hundred dollars. This is a copy of the Sig P365. Look at that beauty, huh? That is an exact copy of the SIG and I can tell you this exact copy because I have a real SIG P365 I just did a review on and uh, this is really a very good training aid nice thing about this this is a uh, blowback which means that slide will come back each time I shoot it, it does uh, take a CO2 cartridge and I think this magazine holds 19 rounds I do have three rounds in it so check this out. The slide's actually going to work on this. I'm going to fire three rounds and it's going to lock back on that last round. See that? I can take the magazine out. All the controls work on this, or most of them. My slide lock, my safety, my magazine release, all work just like a real pistol. The only thing that doesn't work is the takedown lever and it does have a really good set of sights on it look at that just like my real uh, SIG pistol now check out this beauty if you have a Colt 1911 I strongly suggest you pick up a BB gun or a, a 1911 BB gun now look at this this thing operates almost identical to a real um, 1911. So you got your safety here. You have the uh, grip safety, which actually works. Magazine release. There we go. And your takedown uh, lever. 
your bushing comes out just like a real 1911 and the nice thing about this it's all metal when you pick this up I mean it feels like a real gun in fact my real 1911 weighs two pounds and five ounces this weighs two pounds so it it has an almost identical fill and again this one is blowback slide will come back when I shoot it this has a uh, I think this is an 18 round magazine it does take a co2 cartridge and anyways that's the three guns we're going to be shooting today oh another thing my holsters here's a holster for my real 1911 look at that perfect fit same here and on my little sig 365 again perfect fit in my real holsters for my real pistol bam look at that so let's take a look at the bb's the co2's and we'll talk about what it's going to cost you to actually get into something like this and then we're going to do some real shooting okay what's it going to cost you to to shoot your uh, bb gun we already know a bb gun is going to cost you 30 bucks on up to whatever you want to spend you could spend hundreds of dollars on a, on a bb gun anyways uh let's go over some of the bb's and the co2 cartridges because you can't shoot without either one here's a six pack <laughs> six pack that's not a six pack that's six thousand rounds of bb's right there uh, you can pick this up at Walmart for about nine bucks. Here's a, a smaller pack of 1500 if that's more your liking. Here's a Daisy BBs, 2400. I think this was about five dollars or so. You're also going to need CO2 cartridges. This little metal container here has compressed gas in it. This is what's going to work your BB gun. It's going to spit out the BB and it's going to work the slide. How much do those cost? Well, here's a 40 pack I picked up at Walmart for under $16. Of course, you can always go to Amazon and get this for $30, your choice. And make sure you pick up some uh, oil, because what you want to do is put just a drop of oil on top of the, your cylinder before you insert it, okay? That's going to protect the seals in your uh, BB gun. So. Um, my my son who's behind the camera say hi son hey guys we're gonna set up some targets now and uh, do some shooting okay I'm gonna start off with my 1911 I got a co2 cartridge and I'm gonna work on mainly side alignment trigger control and my draw the only negative when it comes to BB gun pistols is the accuracy especially with that little sig with a three inch barrel not real accurate but you can definitely practice your trigger control and side alignment. So let's start off with this 1911 and uh, just do a little shooting. Yeah, see how that locks back? All right, son, you ready to put a few rounds down range? Yep. Let's do it. Go ahead, shoot, son. Get him. There you go. <laughs> killed him. You killed him. You know, if you're going to shoot, you might as well have a little fun, right? Here's some old plates I picked up uh, at Halloween time.
All right, take two. <laughs> Got All right. It. Hit that bottle. All right. Good job. All right. Pops is going to try it with his 45. Yeah, now that's some good training. I do want to mention, with a CO2 cartridge, you can get anywhere from 100 to 200 shots through it, which is pretty cool. And uh, another good thing, you don't have to wear hearing protection, you don't have to pick up any brass, but you do have to wear safety glasses, okay guys? If you're gonna shoot BBs, safety glasses. Yeah. Got it. All right, good job. You did get that, didn't you? Yep. All right, got a balloon out on the old truck. We're gonna take turns and uh, see who can hit it. Go ahead, son, you're first. All right, 45. Oh, you don't usually outshoot your old man. Once in a while. You might be walking home today. Oh. What you got there? Oh, yeah, you got that little sick, don't you? Nice. Hey guys, we're going to wrap it up. It's starting to get a little windy out here, but I'll tell you what, if you need some practice and you don't want to burn up your live ammo, get a BB gun. Get out there, shoot it, and have some fun because we really did get some good training in today. Didn't we, son? We did some good training and it was a lot of fun. So, subscribe, check out Patreon. As always, I appreciate you guys watching my videos. If you leave me a comment, and I don't answer it, it's only because I didn't see it. I get a lot of comments, guys, but thanks. I really do thank everybody for that. Anyways, we'll see you next time. And son, she's all yours.